Teams can stay in the Premiership based on one bat. Yeah, uh, batteries in a watch. Charlie Lakin looking for George. Not a bad ball either. George hasn't got too many options, so we'll try and keep it away from. Look at that. Look at, look at the players. All the, he's done he's really, really well. Really well there because he was just surrounded, weren't he? By the claret shirts. Is it purple? Whatever they are. I've gone with maroon because I don't really maroon. like the word claret. Okay, we're going with maroon. But uh, just shows you how hard though the, the Premiership players and teams work you know you think oh they're all these quality and they do this and they do but you watch their work rate you w watch the intensity of which they close down it's it's uh, fantastic yeah really good stuff from Aidan George to win Blues a corner he's had a little bit more play hasn't he in the last few minutes better with the out swinger attack well and headed down into the ground by Harley Dean Have the necessary power though to really threaten Casper Schmeichel the Blues are back on it here a defending set players, haven't they? Because this must be about the 10th or 12th cross coming in. Yeah, each time it's Telemans over it, an outswinger from that right hand side. It's worked into the feet of Gray. Barnes on the turn. It's a good save from Jacob. Right on the stroke of half time, the closest either side have come to scoring. And it's parried away by the Young Blues goalkeeper, and that is the end of the first half. Amazing, really, isn't it? What a shockingly worked free kick almost turned into a goal because Demario went to control, it went under his foot. Hit on the turn and uh, Jay Cox smart save down to his left hand side. But oh, a free kick from Telemann. Spent more time on the Worcester's turf than the groundsman. As I say, the, the, the midfield players we got in the main. Are, are There's a chance here for Leicester and it's 1 0 to the visitors. Crashed home, left footed from the penalty spot. It's uh, Kiernan Dewsbury Hall who finishes off the move. They were just showing a replay of the earlier chance and it cut to that Leicester City attack. They worked it from the left-hand side and it was Dewsbury Hall, one touch to control. Here you go, it's the hand on and play from Tellemans. One to control and one to finish. Stuff out on that left-hand side, Tellemans involved. and you know, Control with your right, smash it home with your left. Leicester have the lead. Yeah, really bright though, wasn't it, from the free kick? Now I'm feeling much better about that. <laughs> yeah, just 21 years old. He went on loan last season. Here's Jaden Reed, another youngster. The deflection just takes it up and over. Blues looking to hit back for the first time of asking. Yeah, and look at there, Reed. He's, he's manufactured a nice little bit of space for himself. And he, the goal's opened up, you know, as he's done it now. He comes inside and the goal opens up for him. Oh, it's a outstretched foot isn't it yeah just, just got to sneak it inside the near post you know and I, I think the players really struggled with that uh, because of the way the fans are here you know not everybody's like that but certain grounds the fans are very instrumental in the, in the team performance almost yeah Karanka talking about that very hostile St Andrews when it gets going as Jacob clearance is well it's cannons off all bright and it goes in and Leicester City are tuning up by like Musquee here he is again the that's the substitute, and he's beyond that one, but two, and it is yeah. a penalty. It's a tug on the shoulder. He's done really well, hasn't he, Muskie, since he's Muscri. been on. He, he, he's actually added a little bit to them. A young player, you see, got a little bit of energy, a little bit of desire, wants to make an impression. Um, and if I if I was Brendan Rodgers watching, I'd, 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 he'd be getting a couple of ticks today. Mm, David Davis. Seeding the penalty. It might get a <laughs> might get a, a cross now though if he don't score. Ah, great <laughs> save from Zach Jacob. <laughs> Kevin Broder. Yeah, neat save from Zach. That will do him the world of good, given the, the second goal from Leicester. By playing two in there, two defensive ones in there, you should you should be able to keep clean sheets. You know, make it difficult. It's the attacking aspect that you've got to really work on. Yeah, so the referee brings to an end this pre-season friendly. Blues losing this one to Leicester City by two goals to Neil Dewsbury Hall and Mark Albrighton with the second half efforts. Two completely separate teams either side of the break. It's a worthwhile workout for Aitor Karanka's side who got a chance to see both some experienced boys and the Young Academy products as well under his watchful eye.